High five. Oof. My always nice to speak you to some alcohol. Sure, got nothing better to do. Nothing better to do than drink. Free from danger. Oh, you guys don't want any alcohol because what are you doing? <laughs> Miserable. Just miserable. Here, have some alcohol. At least my father will let me drink whatever I want without complaining. Tell Geldis I appreciate it. Okay, I'm Keep it safe. Solstheim's still a dangerous place. Are you threatening, or...? This island's nothing but a... What's the point trying to make a life here? Okay, who else can I give an alcohol to? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Ran out of people. Maybe there's more people in the bar now that it's Why? not the Never seen I've, I've seen like 20 of you in the past 10 seconds. Mr. Goggles doesn't want any. Else down here. The only person in here is Mr. Goggles. He's just staring longingly at the door, hoping someone will take him on an adventure for 500 gold. Dude, <laughs> coming along with me? 500 gold is cheap. I should be paying you every penny in my pocket. The risk you're gonna have to take. God, another mouth to feed. You've picked the wrong town to settle, Alpha. It's okay, I don't eat or sleep I'm like a zombie. That doesn't eat brains. My husband Bendel feared visitors would shun Raven Rock. I'm glad to see he was mistaken. I'm confused. I'll give you quests. Uh I wanted to get the miscellaneous. <laughs> you should give me like little arrows where I can distribute it. Um, oh, I can do that. And that. Warning only once. Stay out of my way, and we'll do just fine. Oof. Oh, I'm sorry. Spare some coin. Lost soul. Don't pity me. And don't look at me like that. I know what I am. Doesn't everyone pity the hopeless? Look at me. I'm no better than a beggar. I used you to be a tell. miner. A good one, too. We all used to be miners. I made more gold digging up ore in a month than some people earn in a lifetime. When the mine dried up, I was lost. I have no other trade, so I spend my time drinking my fortune away at the wretched niche. Or I used to, anyway. Oh. That fetcher Geldis won't even allow me inside. Said I was bad for business. If I want to spend my last bag of coins getting drunk, that's my business. What does he care? You can try. If you can get that stubborn mule to let me into the niche, I'll make sure you get what's coming to you. Why is everybody staring at us while we're having this conversation? Here, have a drink. The day I refuse Sujama from Geldis is the day I sprout <laughs> wings and fly off this rock. I was one of the wealthiest miners in town. I could haul up almost three or four times what the average digger could. I never saw the end coming like it did. The mine running out of ebony. Unlike most of my fellow miners, I was too foolish to save enough coin for that day. The rest I spent on Sujama to drown my sorrows. Councillor Morvane was kind enough to allow Rurns and I Whoa. to live in one of the abandoned buildings. At least it keeps the ash out of our eyes. Thank you, Outlander. It might take more than a simple request what to change What is happening Geldis in this little corridor here? It can be quite stubborn. Causing a traffic, traffic jam. Spare some coin for a lost soul. You've been given My husband, Bendel. It has with Sean Raven Rock. I'm glad Oh, I heard Bendover, not Bendel. Oh, someone's in here. Probably the, uh, mining dude. With the pickaxe. 
looks, this ice still hasn't melted. I'm actually quite impressed. I put a lot in there though. I filled like the entire glass. It's kind of a bad glass to fill though because it's like a goblet. I think it's supposed to be for beer. But I like stuffed two ice cubes in the bottom and then they ended up like making everything else just float up on top. Needless to say, ice didn't fit in there very well. Damn it, woman. I said to leave me be. Precious, last time you explored the mine, you almost fell to your death. I'm not spending the rest of my days as a widow. And I'm telling you that I'll do whatever it takes to find my great-grandfather's remains. He's down here. I can feel it. That was almost two centuries ago. There may be nothing left to find. Just let me go. Oh, coin. Precious, you're an obstinate old fool and you're going to get yourself killed. So, um, this is kind of awkward. I'm going to talk to you, maybe. Who in the blazes are you? Can't you see I'm busy? <laughs> Why should I tell you? I don't even know who you are. Hmm. Maybe. Been difficult trusting people lately. They think I'm crazy. But mark my words, these mines hold a secret that could put Raven Rock back on the map. <laughs> sort of secret. A secret the East Empire Company swept under the rug two centuries ago. It killed my great grandfather and left Raven Rock with a worthless and tainted mine. Mm. Gratian Kyrelius. He oh my spent god. His entire life exploring ancient I ruins no across Tamriel. And he died in these very mines almost 200 years ago. His ghost still haunts the halls. The East Empire Company called it a terrible accident, claiming that he was lost in a rockfall. But I know better. I know better. I can see into the past. My wife and I were cleaning out our home. We came across some of my great grandfather's things locked in an old chest. I found an unsent letter he'd written to the East Empire Company and a key. It describes a discovery that was made in the mine by some of the diggers. They wanted Gratian to take a closer look. The East Empire Company must have felt it was of great value as they locked that section of the mine off from everyone else. Hmm. It is. Well, I assume it is. I haven't been able to find the entrance. Oh. <laughs> I still think you're crazy. Now you're starting to sound like everyone else. <laughs> I'm telling you, there's something big down there. Something that the East Empire Company wanted to hide from everyone. It's probably something big and nasty. Look! My because wife I wife asked. <laughs> I'm too old to go traipsing around these mines chasing my story. Time's my enemy. Caught up with me before I could find the answers that I'm looking for. I do. Mm -mm. I want to know what happened to Gratian and what the East Empire Company is keeping from all of us. Gratian kept a journal of notes about his discoveries. If you can find his remains, I'm hoping it will help. Here's everything I have the letter, the key. Please do this for me. So I can finally regain the respect that I've lost. Here, have a drink. <laughs> He's begging for patrons again, eh? Well, I suppose I could have just a bit. That's what they all say. She thinks that old age has addled my mind. That I'm seeing things when there's nothing to be seen. I it realize she cares about me. But she has to understand that I can't rest until I find out what happened to Gracia. Mm. Then I'll settle down peacefully and never set foot in this mine again. Uh -huh. I've been waiting for this moment for a long time, even before I discovered Gratian's old things. Okay. I just hope both of you don't mistake my enthusiasm for insanity. Maybe it's enthused insanity. But By the way. fool doesn't even deserve to have it. The pickaxe was made for mining, not selling. I'll bet he stole it from the skull in the first place. <laughs> oh, very well. Here, tell him I hope he drops a thing on his foot. Uh. Be careful down there. 
mind can... Why you're leading Cretius on, I'll never understand. Eh, uh, don't worry about it. Have a drink. Well, that sounds lovely. Thank you. Yes! That foolish old man thinks he's 30 years younger than he is. He's going to get himself killed traipsing around the mine. You just found out from... <sighs> He's convinced himself that there's some sort of conspiracy involving the East Empire Company and the mine's closure. We came across some old letters that belonged to his great-grandfather in our house, and he believes every word written in them. He sounds a little... Quiet. Quiet. Oh, the skunk. <laughs> Precious, his great-grandfather worked oh, God. in the East Empire Company. The letters mention some sort of discovery Suddenly. he was sent to investigate. There's really nothing remarkable. It's not too bad yet. I don't know what he's so excited about. Ugh. To understand how we met one another, you have to appreciate what he's going through. Cretius is a third generation miner. All his life he's lived and breathed nothing else. By the time Cretius came of age, oh, right. the ebony mine in Raven Rock was shut down. He took that quite hard. <sighs> At least it's not so bad that I can taste it. Like that one time I was playing Left 4 Dead and all of a sudden I'm like, ugh. Our home has been in his family for over 200 years. Leaving would have been like abandoning precious memories. Instead, he stayed on <sighs> Soul's time and spent most of his life prospecting for a new ebony source. Sadly, it never surfaced. A decade ago, this drove him into a deep depression. He shut himself inside his home and refused to come out. It was after refusing to allow anyone to bring him food. Counselor Morvane ordered his door to be knocked down before Cretius starved to death. I was a temple priest at the time, and they had me use my healing arts to restore strength to his ailing body. I stayed for a while and cared for him, then I suppose we fell in love. Okay. Be careful out there. I got a pickaxe. Nope, oh, that would be under weapons. This is quite the drop. I just kind of like shot down here without even thinking about it. Alright, we're going into a mine now. Mine? Mine? Yeah! Something's nibbling. Can't see. Oh dear. Thankfully, it doesn't last very long. Ah! So it's something nasty in the face. Spiders and the white stuff. Sure. 
where I'm supposed to be going right now. that means gas leak. Do not start any fires in this hallway. Ugh. It's probably under a deck again. Skunk likes it under the deck. Not exactly sure why. Bucket! It's an, immo it's an immovable bucket. I accidentally picked it up. Bucket. Ah! That was anticlimactic. <laughs> than the, uh, like, apprentice ones. Okay, I obviously came the right way. What are we going to find in the depths of this mine? Probably a disgusting death. That's almost guaranteed, though. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm just hiccuping. Hello. Hold, hold on, hold on, hold on, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ah! I missed. Ah! It's okay. See me. 
secret everybody was worried about. Stay down. Hi. Ah! Oh, you're not alive. doesn't look safe. Doors are gonna like swing shut behind me and dudes are gonna pop out. Well the doors didn't swing shut, that's a good sign.
but it still turned out. Oh my god, it's a master. Okay, I'm gonna go refill my water and then 